Our work ranges quite a lot. We do everything from sort of classic graphic design through to art direction. We love working on projects really holistically where we get to sort of craft um, a lot of different touch points all together. And we love um, bringing everything to life in animation. We love doing packaging, a bit of copywriting. Um, and yeah, I think we have a lot of fun doing a bit of everything. We always start our day with coffee because we can't really function without it. Then we'll usually get pretty much straight into work, whether that's a meeting or just updating kind of projects. Body care brand Billy is one of our clients, so we might pop into their office at some point during the week. Then we'll do a walk. Then we will sit down to dinner. What are we eating tonight, Jess? Mm, delish. <laughs> Lots of poopy. And that usually <laughs> involves bouncing Luca in the bouncer while we eat. We live a couple of blocks away from Pratt and they have a really nice sculpture garden. Um... There are lots of really good coffee spots. Really peaceful and quiet. We also love coming down to Fort Green Park as often as we can. They've got a really cute tennis court and it just lets us stretch our legs. So we work from home, um, so we'll either be working from out here at the kitchen table or from the couch or um, in this office space here, which is a shared area with all of our son's stuff. So that's why there's a change table and a bunch of kids' books and toys. Uh, but we uh, work in front of the window here, just on our laptops. Noemi uses the stool, I'm on the right, and then uh, we have a nice view of our building's courtyard. Uh, I think it means that we sort of most of the time end up getting the best of both worlds. When we are in Melbourne, we're sort of around a lot of our family and friends. And then when we come back to New York, uh, life is a little bit more chaotic, but I think we sort of like that. Um, it also just means we're in the same time zone as a lot of our clients, which is a lot nicer. Um, and it also means that we can kind of decide what season we want to be in. Our work-life balance is pretty blurred. Like we, and having a baby only probably blurs it even more. Um, so our, you know, our general working hours are kind of all over the place. We just work whenever to get stuff done. Um, and we end up just working. <laughs> we end up working a lot, um, but we don't mind because we really love what we do. We really like all the projects we work on. And so, um, we just, you know, try and have fun. I think a lot of what has inspired our work is probably our childhood and the decade that we grew up in, which is the 90s. Um, just a small example of that is this brand Esprit, which was around when we were kids. Um, the um, clothes themselves weren't really anything special, but the art direction that sort of surrounded the brand, um, the packaging, um, was always really, really fun and fresh. The stores were actually designed by Tori Sotsis, which is kind of mind blowing in hindsight. I think from my perspective, um, following your gut and, and you know, trusting your intuition is, has been like crucial for us. Um, whether it be, uh, you know, the project you work on or design choice, creative choice, um, we've found that following our gut has just been critical to, you know, making things just like go well. I think working out ways to tap into what makes you truly happy and figuring out how to get more of that in your everyday work.
This little guy has made us pretty happy. Even though our day is filled with moments like this, Luca, let go of the plant. Let go of the plant. We like cooking a lot and we like hanging out in our apartment and we like going on walks um, and traveling, we love traveling. My personal dream job would be to design for a magazine. I just picked up this magazine, Kindling, from my friend's bookstore, and it's probably along the lines of what I would love to do. It's just really fun, beautiful editorial. I watch a lot of NBA, I watch a lot of sports, um, so it'd be great to be able to design something to do with that. Our most recent favorite project is La Puzz. It's a puzzle company um, that came to us in 2020 to do all of their design work leading up to launch. We did everything for them. We did the branding, we did the website, the packaging. We especially love the back of the boxes that have all these little mini games and puzzles on them. The client have a really good sense of humor and it's just been a lot of fun.